Da booty though. Oh, you touched my ta la la. Still fucking sick. The Atlas looks ridiculously bad. I mean, the guy that created the Atlas must be without eyes. Jabba the Hutt looks better than the Atlas. Oh my god, dude, you fucking kidding me. This is basically a fucking video on which I will be like complimenting Rockstar. You guys definitely know Rockstar. Rockstar are the guys that created GTA and a bunch of other titles. But definitely their main, main, main title. How the fuck did that not kill him? You guys know that I take business administration uh, in uni. So something about business I know. Not a lot, definitely, definitely. I still have a shit ton to learn, but you know, a list of basics, that's what I know. And I need to say, fucking Rockstar, you're a genius. Rockstar is by far the smartest video game company of the last possibly decade. Those guys are fucking geniuses. Just think of what they did during the last year, okay? They released GTA 5 on Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3. Pretty damn good game. Then they released GTA on Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Wow, okay, graphics is better and you can go into first person, cool. But the game is basically the same. Then they released, they're gonna release uh, GTA 5 on PC. I mean, they are fucking geniuses, okay? They, they created a game, which is pretty damn good. I'm having fun playing GTA 5 on Xbox One. They released this one game and they per perfectly understood what the different customers want. Customers that have the Xbox One, customers that have the Xbox 360 and customers that have PC. They understood perfectly what they wanted to do. That That's so, so, so smart, man. So smart. In business terms, there is one thing that is called the target customer, which means what kind of person do you want to sell your product to? And this usually differs demographic stuff like age, uh, nation, place, some that kind of stuff, uh, income levels, salaries, and also, especially in this case, it depends on which platform the game is gonna be played. Let's put it this way: people that have a past gen uh, Xbox 360 or PlayStation 3 console, they are si they simply want to play the game. They don't give a shit about graphics and stuff like that. They simply want to have fun. For that reason, they released it first on Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3. After that, after they, they, they definitely saw that the amazing amount of success, they were like, oh, okay, you know what? We gotta also target also the people that bought the Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Because those guys bought those consoles because they want a little bit better, you know, graphic quality and maybe something cool inside. For that reason, we're gonna release GTA 5 on Xbox One and PlayStation 4, better graphics and first person POV wow GG last but not least they're gonna release GTA 5 on PC they know that PC players are usually people that like want the max amount of graphics and like explosions and stuff like that they want they look they, they want the game to look like a fucking movie for that reason they're gonna release the GTA 5 on console this uh, I'm sorry on PC the exact way it has been released on console on Xbox One and Xbox 360 although and here is what will get all the PC players to buy GTA 5 you will get access to mods which on PC is like the modding community around GTA, GTA series is fucking huge on PC bro and they are also gonna release the game that can be played in 4k they're gonna make all the new textures and stuff like that they understood exactly exactly what you know the different customers the different target types wanted how the fuck did i spawn here i feel sorry for dude how the fuck did he spawn there people are rockstar dude you guys are fucking geniuses whoever you know took care of the marketing campaign and the kind of good stuff He's a fucking genius, a businessman with the beat.